Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be reviewing this 2025 Nissan Altima. Now, when you come onto the front end, you can see the hood being raised in the center and then flattens out on both sides. And now when you come to the front, you can see the new Nissan logo with this black grill with the red SR badge. And then we have these all LED headlamps with LED day running lights. And that's the front bumper and this is our overall front look and now when we come onto the side we can see this gorgeous alloy wheels in two tone a silver and glossy black finish so we have a black and silver alloy wheels and 19 inch alloy wheels on the front and over on the rear and when we come to the back we can see the ultima badging over here nissan logo up center the red sr badging up here with these LED tail lamps and let's enter its engine compartment and now under the hood we have a 2.5 liter direct injection 4 cylinder that produces 182 horsepower and 178 pound feet of torque that goes through a CVT automatic transmission fuel economy is 25 around town and 34 on the highway we have this blacked out mirror caps and, and then we have this chrome piece running throughout the window up until here and now when we open the back door we have body colored door handles and now when we come inside the back door we have hard plastic up here but then here we have soft touch and leather this is leather with the red stitching since it's the SR variant so yeah I like this leather door handles glossy back paint window controls cup holders and now when we come onto the seats oh wow even the back seats have SRS airbags cool and then as you can see we have these leather seats that are perforated with red stitchings and this is the interior at the back let's jump in and as you can see for example I'm 5758 I have a lot of leg room yeah a little tight on the headroom but not too bad at least I fit we have a USB A and a USB C port at the back, but no AC vents. But then, yeah, the seats are quite comfortable. Then, when we come onto the front, the game changes. We have soft touch up here, and then we have these cool silver trim that runs connects to our chrome door handle. Silver door handle looks good. And then we have more soft touch down here, red stitching, glossy black finish with show my power. gratitude to Stucky Nissan of State College who let me spend some time with Ultim with the Nissan Altima so that I can film it for you guys and please hit that like button hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed my video with all four power window controls lock unlock child lock adjustment for the mirrors cup holders down here these are automatic adjustment seats and then when we come onto the front these are leather as well with perforations if we sit inside we can see the button to open the trunk the trip reset we have these gorgeous AC vents I do really like the carbon fiber trim up here it kind of gives the vibe of a carbon fiber trim then we have soft touch over the steering and then if we come over here, wow, I have never seen a fuel cap locator over here. There's our fuel cap locator. And then we have a nice trim around the steering wheel. Soft touch. We have the Nissan logo up center with the horn. And then we have like cruise control. I do really like the whole steering wheel. And then, yeah, it has the newer 12-inch infotainment system in the Ultima. Looks pretty cool. And then we have some physical controls for the touchscreen. And then we do have these cool ac vents we have physical buttons for the climate control the temperature fan speed air condition and then front defogger rear defogger and yeah it does get the heated seats and then as you can see how clear and it has a good response time so yeah the thing have a good response time and then as you can see this is our CVT gear shifter with this silver accent on top that looks pretty cool and then we have this engine start stop button up here and then yep 
so that's pretty cool and we have a wireless charging pad down here with a usb a usb c port 12 volt socket we have two cup holders up here we have an electronic parking brake up here and then i really like the red stitching on the extronic cvt gear shifter and if you are wondering this button it's the sports mode i so, love this trim on the hand rest and with the red stitching it's soft touch and as you can see we have a deep storage down here good enough so it's this and i really like this gloss black segment that runs all the way over there to the other side and then as if and then this is our glove box pretty decent glove box and so that we have this manual irvm over here we have our sunglass holder and then we have our lights over here and then if you are wondering this car does get a sunroof yeah we do have this sunroof over here and that's how it is pretty good size sunroof i would say for a sedan and then i do really like the headliner and then we have the sun shades with the mirror and a light on top and now let's check its trunk space so as you can see it the trunk opens up and then you can lift it from with your hand and then you can see it has a pretty practical size trunk a huge trunk it has a low floor for easy loading and then you can see we have these tabs to throw down the seats for extra storage but for a normal family that's without that is good and then we have the backlight up here and then you can see the back it has a backup camera as well and then you can just close the trunk manually and then we even have the all-wheel drive badging back there since it's the all-wheel drive variant and you can see the ultima badge as shown with these led tail lamps that look pretty cool and now let's look at its window sticker. The tw this is the window sticker for the 2025 Nissan Altima SR all-wheel drive sedan. And as you can see, the MSRP is $35,690, so approximately $36,000. And as you can see, uh, the base price is $30,000 and it has a, this paint costs $425. And then here's a, another quick look at the fuel efficiency. And then, and then these are the black mirrors. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Every like, share, and subscribe counts. I'll see you guys in the next one. And stay tuned for more videos on my channel.